What up, world? It's your boy Jay Winks back in the building today. You're now in tune to the Winks Steel channel. Yes, uh, get my notes right here, real quick. I hope y'all having a good Saturday afternoon. It was a beautiful day, starting to rain a little bit. I don't know. I don't know if it's raining right now outside. I can't really tell on my balcony. But like I said, it's your boy Jay Winks. Now. I'm going to start off the channel a little different. Now, I said last week, last, well, last three or four weeks, that I was going to do an episode for my birthday. Excuse me, I'm still in my work uniform. But things didn't go right. I had to work, running around. I was feeling myself too much. And then when I thought about recording, let's just say I was going downhill when I thought about recording. But... I want to thank everybody who wished me a happy birthday, text, messaged me, called me, and everything like that. I I appreciate it. You know, turn 37 is a blessing. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, and, uh, thank you to all my family and my friends that came out with me last Saturday night. Uh, I had fun, very fun time. You know what I'm saying? I don't, we don't get to go out that much, you know, with COVID and everything like that. So it was just a different being around adults, you know, so it was a good time. I wish I took more pictures. We did what pictures on Snapchat, didn't we? Yep. That that was it. So if you was, uh, if you follow me on Snapchat, those are all the pictures you got. I was. So merch update. Yes. Um. Uh, I will have new merch coming soon. Excuse me. I got colored bags now. So instead of the black bags that I've been uh, giving to everybody, I got colored bags now. So whatever color you would like, hit me up. I'll do it. Tie-dye bags are coming too. Here soon. I got one tie-dye bag done so far, but we're going to work on it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so just be waiting out. The merge is coming. I'm going to say second, third week of May. I'm going to have all of it. New music today. Now, I'm not going to do a lot of new music because there was a whole bunch that's happened in the last three weeks. From the Bel Air, I mean, the uh, Drip of Gold episode from the Easter to last week not doing the episode. So I'm only going to do two albums this week. I'm going to try and hit my dudes up and try and see if we can do a hip-hop talk. Next week's video will be late. I have to work until 4, so the video will be up at 6 next Saturday. So, watch out for that. Like I said, new music. Alchemist has dropped a, a digital album. It won't be out until the 30th on all platforms. Vinyls will be out that same day. I, myself, went, bought it digitally, downloaded it. It was cheap, so you know what I'm saying? Eight songs on there. The album is called The Things of Ours. Like I said, April 30th, it will be out on all platforms. There's four songs, four instrumentals. I'm a big Uncle Al fan, so whatever he drops, I got to go get. I got to go listen to it. Next up, the homie Ty Ferris dropped a bomb project. I mean a bomb project. None of his projects, I've been listening to him for a year now. None of his projects he's dropped. And his last year sounded the same. But this one is Dark Nice, Indeed Fitted. It's a dope album. Bars to death, like I said. Ty Ferris. Going on today, we into the Vinyl Talk. Yes, so this is the Boom Bat edition of the Vinyl Talk. Now, before I get into my vinyls and stuff, like Boom Bat started in the early, uh, early 80s. KRS One, uh, a lot of those groups in the early '80s and '90s. You put Wu Tang, Nas, uh, Jay Z, Tribe Called Quest, The Far Side, Busta Rhymes. I'm just naming a few artists that I'm going to be talking about. Boom Bap is still going on right right now. You got a lot of people who don't like the drumless or the drums, but the Boom Bap is is there. 2020, you didn't think like hip hop would be changing going back to that gritty, grimier music. But going on with the first vinyl talk today, this is the far side. 
Bizarre Ride 2. This album came out in 1992. This is their debut album. Uh, my uncles used to listen to them. Now, they listened to their second album that's got running on there. But Passing Me By was one of my favorite songs. Uh, so, let's get there with the three songs. Um, first song I want to shout out, Oh Shit. Second song, I already said it, Passing Me By. Third song, now this is a remix, Soul Flower. Like I said, Far Side. Show you all the vinyls. That's why I'm going to start doing, showing you some of the vinyls and stuff like that. See what color it is. I have played this one. And it's two different colors. So I'm going to show you, you guys this. We got this blue one right here. Got this gold one. Pretty gold one right here. Next up, now I talked about this album, I think maybe my second or third episode. I just talked about it with new music that was re released. Now I got this vinyl maybe two to three weeks. I don't remember. Because I haven't even opened it yet. Yeah. But this is Busta Rhymes ELE2. Like I said, I haven't opened it, so I'm going to open it in front of y'all. Give me one second. I listened to it on Spotify and everything like that. I haven't went through all 22 tracks. There's nothing wrong with having 22 songs on there. Uh, like I said, I've been a big Buster Rhymes fan since uh, Wuha. Um, that was his first uh, office uh, first album to come in. His second album with Disaster Strikes. Now this is part two of ELE. This has been 22 years in the making. So this album came out 22 years from the original ELE that had, uh, I forget the song that him and Janet Jackson had. What's it going to be? I think that's the song called. So let me open this. Oh, let me tell you who's on here. You got Chris Rock, Rakim, Pete Rock, MLP, Belle de DeVoe, ODB, Q-Tip, Rick Ross, Anderson Pack, Rhapsody, Mariah Carey, Kendrick, Mary J. Blige. So a lot of people on here. 22 songs, like I said. Show you all the back. So let's open this baby. Ooh. That's kind of dope. Yeah, that's kind of dope right here. I ain't never seen a vinyl like that, two different colors like that. Love it. Color in here or not. Oh, the same color. Let me put this back real quick. I'll get it after the show. Next up, now, he just won his first Grammy. Um... Uh, Maybe a month ago, I forget when the Grammys happened. Uh, it was between him and uh, Freddie Gibbs, Alfredo. New Belgium, Buddha. But Nas King Disease, yes. Um, I think I might show it on Facebook Live. Uh, a great album. I'm glad Nas finally got that Grammy. Hey, I mean, like, this is my... Force Nas vinyl. So I have three more I need to get, and I'm done with Nas. So I'm trying to think, which one do I need? I need Godson, Street Disciples, and Still Automatic, and then I'm done. 
But three songs, uh, Full Circle, Future in the Firm, that's AZ, Foxy Brown, and Cormega. Uh, second song, I'm going to shout out, Car 85, featuring Charlie Wilson. And third song, I want to shout out, 10 Points. I think this is a red vinyl, so I'm going to bring it out. Yes, yeah, a red vinyl. So, yep, Nas King Disease. And before I go, this is a new little segment. This is uh, Secret Gems. You know, a lot of people don't know this. I like to read. So, here is 1984, the year I was born. Yep, by George Orwell. A great book. It's in paperback. Uh, I've read this book once before, but it's a great book. It talks about populists and everything like that, kind of Trump, how Trump gets in office. But it's a great book. So I'm going to be starting to do a little bit more about books and stuff like that. So get hip. Let's get some reading done. Any of my friends who read, hey, let's get there. It's your boy, Jay Winks. This is the Boom Bat Vinyl Talk. I will see y'all next week. Remember, the episode will be up around 5 or 6 o'clock. I'll holler. Y'all have a good weekend. Ow!